First of all, I really like that outfit. Thank you. I thought it was appropriate to make sort of like a Catwoman suit. Where did you get that? It's a Baslow. All right, well, tell everybody who you are. Uh, I am Kelly Jekyll, and I'm very excited to be here, very excited to sing tonight. What are you going to be singing? I will be singing Everybody Wants to Be a Cat, sort of a slow, slinky, jazzy version. Are you going to wear that? I'm actually not. I'm wearing something similar with, with long black gloves. I'm very excited, yeah. What inspired you to be part of this entire event? Well, I mean, any charity that benefits any type of creature that's suffering is is worthwhile, I think. And um, they contacted me, and I looked into it, and I just thought, what a great charity, what a great opportunity. And, you know, the people involved are some really special people, and so it's really fun, yeah. So what um, are you going to be looking forward to tonight, the best part of tonight for you? What do you think that would be? I, I, Besides singing, of course. Yes. Um, well, I just hopefully getting to watch a few of the other performances. I've made some friends in this process, and I love to watch other people wow me. And there's incredible people performing how much tonight. Was, how much rehearsal time did you have? We rehearsed uh, once this week, and we rehearsed yesterday, and then we rehearsed this morning. That's it? Mm -hmm. Wow, incredible. Now, do you have pets? I do. I have a dog at home, at home with, with my parents in Sacramento. Um, I used to have a cat. We used to have a cat growing up, and um, I love all animals. I'm an animal lover. Any animal that wants to be loved, I want to love, truly. <laughs> so what's coming up for you next? What's on your plate? Um, well, tomorrow, actually, I am releasing a music video. It's a cover of a Paramore song called Ain't It Fun on my YouTube channel, which is Kelly Jekyll Music, and then on iTunes as well. And um, my next question, social media, Twitter, Facebook, do you have all of that? I am Twitter, um, backslash Kelly Jekyll. Pretty much everything is Kelly Jekyll, except for my YouTube, is Kelly Jekyll Music. Just spell the last names for everyone. Uh, well, it's K-E-L-L-E-Y-J-A-K-L-E. -L -L -E. I know, it's kind of tough. Yeah, because I was thinking a whole other <laughs> I know. I know. What was I thinking? J-E-C-K something, whatever. But no, thank you so much. It's, it's all right. <laughs> but yeah, so um, some exciting things coming up, but mostly excited for tonight. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks for talking with us. Have fun tonight. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> That's like you. Got it. <laughs> cute, cute. Love it. Well, you know, you are here supporting. Tell us why, what inspired you. Uh, I love me some kitty cats. Um, I've had cats my whole life. Got uh, three at home right now, all rescues, two of them feral. And, uh, you know, it's, it's about, it's the most anti-message, which is we want less cats out there. That's, that's the message. Just, we, don't, we have enough cats. Let's spay and neuter our kitty cats and uh, stop the cat population from growing. So you have two feral and you have one domesticated, and how did they all they're get along? All domesticated. All, right, but how did they all get along when you brought the two in? Um, mm, no, no, they get along. They're, okay. they're fine. Yeah, they do, they do well together. You know, it's been a lot of years now, but, you know, the, the two feral ones, it was, you know, it was three or four years of really working hard at making sure they were okay and comfortable, and they, one of them would disappear for a week at a time, but but wouldn't go anymore. Just stay somewhere. and was scared, terrified. You know, they're just. It's a hard life. Feral cats is a hard life, and luckily we got them in time. But um, you know, it's, it, there's no need for that. The cats need. There's no need to be born on the streets. They should be all taken care of in spay and neuter. So there's not. They're not born in alleyways anymore. What's coming up for you next? You have a lot going on. You know, got a lot of. I got a lot of voiceover cartoon stuff going on. I'm doing Cougar Town this season. Courtney Cox. Yeah. So it's. Uh, you know, and uh, Wendell and Vinny and Nickelodeon still is going to finishing our episodes off in, in October. So, okay, 
Well, I'm a fan, so I can't wait to see it. So thank thank you, you so much for taking time to talk with us. Nice talking to you, too. Have fun with the show. Thank you, I will. Well, you make it quick. You know what you got to do. Tell everybody why you're doing this and what it's about and how to should support. That's yes. it. This is Kitty Bungalow Charm School for Wayward Cats. We specialize in feral cats and socializing them. Feral cats have a 0% rate of survival in city shelters. We bring those cats in before they ever hit the shelters. We have 40 volunteers that work with them day in and day out, and they turn into the sweetest little babies. Um, we adopt them out. We have, we're almost at our 400th cat. Um, and we do a lot of spay neuter because kittens are cute, but I kind of wish that they were really ugly and poisonous at first. So people would stop going, oh, I just, look, it's a cute kitten. And then like maybe they turn cute when they're nine weeks old or something um, because there are too many cats. Uh, so tonight we put on a big celebrity spectacular and we do this um, to raise money. It raises about 75% of our operating budget. It is a huge undertaking and it's all done on donations and sponsors. Thank you, Donna. You are the best. Thank you, Joy, and we look forward to more reports from richgirlnetwork.tv and Rich Girl on the Red Carpet. That's it for all of us here at Newswire LA. We thank you for joining us. To follow everything Newswire LA, look us up on Facebook and Twitter at Newswire LA. That's it. This is Chin Thomas Sangsi saying so long, and we'll see you back here next time.